Hello student. Today we are going to discuss about the most important JavaScript functions. I will suggest you to pay attention to this class because the lecture that I am going to give today is most important. So if you can understand whatever I am going to teach you today in this class, that particular knowledge that you will carry for your future to be a very good programmer so to develop the front end application you need to apply several functions of javascript so i am going to discuss about all those important in, in fact very very important javascript functions so in long run you will understand that how you can use these functions to develop a uh, front-end software or a long length program where you have to develop an application front-end so this is going to be very vital class for all of you so I will suggest to all of you that please pay attention and try to understand today's class whatever I am going to explain you today this thing is going to be very important for you and this is going to be a building block experiences for you so without wasting any more time let us start so first function that I am going to discuss that is length function JavaScript has a length function so that it can count the number of characters of a input text so let us try that length function so you can see this is the syntax of writing the length function so the length property return the length of a string so it will just count the length of a string so a string length that will be counted and it start from zero right so let us start so here first thing I have to do script opening tag and closing right and inside this here I will write let us have a input from the user so for that I can do one thing I will ask the user to write something so here the user will write something so enter name so I am asking the user to enter name now the name that the user is going to provide that I will store in a variable so I will declare a variable to store the name that will be given by the user now I will calculate the length of the name of the user so to do that X will hold the name that will be given by the user now here I will just use X dot L E N G T H X dot length so now this function will calculate the length of X that means X hold the name that will be given and X will hold the length and that will be here converted to the length so let me show you if I write here document dot write inside this if I write X now if I execute now you can see asking for a name if I write so simply the name has been printed but I want to find the length of this name so what I will do over here so you can see instead of that I will write x dot length now this length function will return the length it will count the number of character in the name now see again I will write my name and ok you can see the number of character has been printed 8 right so I will just do one thing I will use a heading tag so that it will appear larger it will be easy for us to view right and also I will get it right at the horizontal center right let me again repeat right, this is the length of the character you can see this is the length of the name that has been given by the user fine so now let us move to the next function so javascript string index of function what this particular function will do so this index of function method return the position of the first occurrence of the value in a string so this particular method will return the occurrence of the string value so I have to search a value so we are going to search uh, a text or a word or something from a given string right and if that that is found then the position will be shown and in case after searching if that is not found it will return minus one and this method is case sensitive right so let me execute otherwise you will not able to understand just see what I will be doing now so here I will use index of function index of now this is the string right so the string will be given by the user now instead of length function I am going to use index of I N D E X index o f index o f o capital o f function and here i will be searching for say uh, india 
I will be searching for the word India right now if you see the parameter over here we ha also need to mention from where the starting the, s the searching will start the position from where the searching will start right now I will write the position 0 that means 0 means the first character 1 means second character 2 means third character so the searching will start from 0 that means from the first character so now try to understand this method so x that is the string so wh whatever user will provide that will be saved in x and x dot index of that means inside this string this index of method will search this India written text it will search India and the searching will start from 0th location this is location from 0th location means from the first location so now let me save the file and let me execute so here I will write I love my country India so now from this this is a string that I have written from this string as per this program India will be search index of method will search India and the searching will start from zero location so the searching will start from zero location so zero location means I so I exist at the zero location so right so let me execute now see minus one that means it has not been found why it has not been found let me show you see what I have written I N D I A and you can see index of method is case sensitive right so now if I execute this again and now if I write I L O V E love my country country I N D I A so now I have written India in small letter but previously I had written I of India in capital letter that is why as because this method is case sensitive it return minus one minus one when it will return minus one if the value is not found if the value is not found after searching then it will return this method will return minus one so as because previously I have written I in capital but inside the program it was searching India with small letter I everything is written in small letter so that is why it has not matches with the string but now it will match because now I have written India in small letter now if I click OK now you can see 18th so India started from that 18th location right I hope you have understood so let me just change this here I will write L O V E right so L capital I have written L in capital right from this string the string that will be provided by the user from this string by the index of method this love will be this written text love that will be searched for and the searching will start from the zeroth location right so let me execute again so let me save the file and I will execute now again I will write I L O V E love my India so this love will be searched and try to find the location where this has been started the first occurrence right for if I write L O V E repeatedly and repeatedly it will search here only so after this love will be searched and found rest of the text will be ignored L rest of the text will be just ignored right it will only search the first occurrence of the given search value so this is known as you can see search value so this search value will be search inside the string right the search value will be search inside the string and it just does not matter that how many time that value has been printed it will go and try to find the first occurrence and that position will be shown now just you uh, see the where this this first occurrence is 0 1 0 i 0 space will also be counted the space will also be counted right now you can see 2 0 1 2 i then space then love l so the l the starting of l that has been returned right 2 i then space and then l o v e l for love l that l value has been returned its position has started from 2 right i hope you have understood now if I do one thing just let me explain to you now if I start from 3 that means if I write execute the program again see the searching will start from 3 position right let me show you so if I execute if I write the same thing I love my India right now again I write love so 
two times I have written love but you can see the searching will start from third position that is 0 1 2 3 that means 0 0 space is 1 L is 2 right and O is 3 so from this position searching will start that means this particular written text love will not be search this love will be search right then now let me execute 16 i hope you have understood now if i simply write i l o v e love my india so only this love is written once and if i start from the third position of uh, searching then it will return minus one that will not be found right i hope you have understood this index of and this can be used in long program to fetch data from a given string and this is very important for you to understand so now let me discuss about this function last index of right so unlike the previous one index of last index of will return the last occurrence of a search value last occurrence of the search value okay and you can see that last occurrence of a specified value in a string and last index of method search the string from the end to beginning okay in just index of method search from start to end start to end but last index of method search from the end to beginning end to beginning not beginning to end end to beginning right so let me execute so here i will write l a s t last index of method i will be capital o will be capital last index of of this value i will search for love now here as i told you no this has to be the last value now count i space l o v e space m y my country space c o u n t r y so it's 17 it will start from 17 or you can write 16 right so it will start from the last that, that means from the end so now let me save the file so here i will write i l o v e love my country now try to find the length 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 so it's a 17 character length and the searching will start from 16 character from the last that means the searching will count from start from not from y from r now you can see what is it has been shown 2 right right so searching will start from there and it will return 2 because you can see i l o v e love my country so you can see 0 1 2 right but the searching will start from here so the best way to write over here you may not know that what could be the length of the string that the user is going to give right in this case you can write here x dot length x dot length minus you have to find the x dot length function will find the length of the string that the user is going to provide right and as because the searching is going to start from a zero index so you always need to subtract by one so so that it will start the searching from the last character of a given string you may not know what could be the length will you go and count every time that the user is going to uh, give a character it, it is not possible no so this is how you can write x dot length minus one okay as because it is going to search from the last so let me save the file and now if i go and execute okay if i write the same word now you can see okay this is how it will execute now let me discuss about this function javascript string match so what this function will do right so this match method okay it's a string against regular expression right so it will just going to match uh, a given string right so you can see the match value that you have to provide over here right and that will be matched with the string if that is found that will be printed let me show you so here i will write m a t c h right and if this india if this word india will exit in the string that will be provided by the user then that will be printed otherwise it will show null so let me just save and execute so here i have written i love my country india 
now you can see in the program India will be searched for in the string right so you have to delete this so this thing will be searched in the string in the x x holds the string that is going to be provided by the user now let me execute the program so here I write ok so null that has not been found why just check I have to write India because we are searching for India now you can see India India has been printed why we India has been matches so this this value matches with the string value right now if I write here country if I write here country country this value will be searched in the string x if that is found then it will print otherwise it will show null let me execute country will be searched for in the string that the user is going to provide right if matches string dot matches method will run if this country is found that particular word is found then it will return the word otherwise it will simply return null right let me execute now let me press ok country has been found right now if I just remove the country from here then it will return null because it has not been found if that will not be found it will return null now let me discuss this repeat method okay this repeat method will copy the string that will be given by the user and it will repeat number of time very easy I will write here R E P P E A T repeat R E P E A T repeat now how many time I want the what or the sentence to be repeated say two times so user will give a uh, sentence or word something the user will write and that will be accepted in the variable string and and then this repeat method will repeat that that whatever the user has given that will be repeated how many times two times let me execute so I have written hello student so this thing I have written so this thing will be repeated twice see hello student hello student so if I had written 4 then let me write hello student so this hello student will be repeated four times right so this is x dot repeat and then how many time it will be repeated that I that value you have to mention this is the syntax of writing this repeat method right so it will repeat the string the string value will be repeated right fine now we are going to discuss replace right so let me show you how this can be used so here I will write replace R E P L A C E replace so here two parameter you have to add right the first parameter is that you have to find a string find a sub string you, I will say sub string from the string that will be given by the user right so let me find India so I am searching for India where in the X so I am searching for India in the X where user will write something because I have written x dot replace so I am searching for India and India will be replaced by Pakistan 
so india will be replaced by pakistan so if you the right any sentence where this india word exist then this replace method will first find the word india then if this particular word has been found then that word will be replaced by another word pakistan so this is the word that has to be searched for and this is the replacement word right so let me save the file and let me execute so here i'll write love my country india so if i click okay then from this string this india word will be search for right this replace method will search india and if the if the word has been found then it will be replaced by pakistan and that will be printed over here so let me write see i love my country pakistan right now if i write i love my country bangladesh i love my country bangladesh but it is searching for india no it is searching for india right so india will not be found over here right that is why this replace function will return false right now if i click okay simply it will be printed i love my country bangladesh because you can see here that it is searching for the word india india has not been found in the string because user has not written that particular word india in that sentence right so that is why if this particular word has not been found then a replacement will not take place it will not be replaced right this method will return false and replacement will not take place simply that whatever the user has written that will be printed right so i can simply do another thing so i will take another variable here variable y p r o m p t prompt and here i will write e n t e r enter search value enter search word right so i am asking the user to give two value there will be a string right and after that a search value right and that will be saved in y right so x dot replace will get this x value that means the full sentences now instead of writing uh, uh, writing india over here i will write y because i am asking the user to write a word that will be searched for in this string so that will be put into y right and y will be searched in the x this y value will be searched in the x value right and if that has been found then only replacement will take place so let me execute see so it is it is not name i will write here enter full sentence sentence so now i will execute enter full sentence so i love my country bangladesh right so i love my country bangladesh this is the first sentence user has given and that will be saved in x x will hold this sentence now okay again i have been uh, asked for to write the word that will be search in that sentence so i will write bangladesh so now x hold i love my country bangladesh y hold bangladesh right and as because why hold bangladesh bangladesh will be search in x 
and if that has been found then it will be replaced by Pakistan R let us see I love my country Pakistan I hope you have understood right so let me now solve this one this function JavaScript string search right so it will just go and search the string and show the location okay you can see this method will just uh, try to find that position of the first match right so see search so you just simply write here if I write here search S E A R C H right so I have written S E A R C H search and here I will write Y only Y so search value will be provided by the user only user will provide two value string value and search value search value this this value will be search in the X sentence and the result will be printed so let me save so I love my country Pakistan full text sentence and what will you search for that I am going to write now enter the search word I will write love I will write love I will click OK see 2 so the index position that has been shown the position right you can see the position 0 0 1 and 2 so this position has been shown if I write my m y what will be the position just see 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 right 6 or 7 will be shown if I write here my my 6 or 7 see 7 I hope you have understood what this particular function do search function will search and show the that particular index location index location index location now this one okay slice what this will do slice okay we will just extract a part of string right so method extract a part of string method return extracted part in a new string okay and method does not change the original string right so the start and the end parameter specifies the part of the string to be extracted so this is the syntax start and end s l i c e right s l i c e so here i have to write the start parameter and end parameter right i have to write the start parameter from it will just extract word from the sentence and that will be printed right have you understood and we have to mention that from where to where it will extract from where to where that means from where it will start the counting and till where it will take the word from so 2 to 5 so let me execute ok so first I will give a full sentence I if I write my name Vishwajit right let me click ok now see S W A S W A right just see B I S W A J I T so it has been shown S W A why 0 1 2 3 4 5 see 2 to 5 right now you can count over here 0 uh, B 0 B 0 I 1 S 2 so from 2 start uh, it will start from 2 and end at 5 now you can match it after 2 3 4 ok and till 5 right that is why it has been shown see 
टू थ्री फोर फाइव विल नॉट बी शोन नंबर फाइव विल नॉट बी शोन टिल फोर विल बी शोन बिकॉज अप टू फाइव अप टू फाइव इट विल एक्सट्रैक्ट सो आई होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड दिस पर्टिकुलर फंक्शन नाउ लेट मी एक्सिक्यूट दिस फंक्शन स्प्लिट ओके इट विल सिंपली स्प्लिट अ लॉन्ग सेंटेंसेस इन टू मल्टीपल सेंटेंसेस इट विल सिंपली स्प्लिट अ लॉन्ग सेंटेंसेस इन टू मल्टीपल वर्ड और सब सेंटेंसेस मल्टीपल वर्ड और सब सेंटेंसेस राइट बट वी नीड टू थ्रो अ सेपरेटर वाट कुड बी द सेपरेटर दैट वी हैव टू डिसाइड एंड ऑल्सो आर लिमिट ऑल्सो आर लिमिट सो लेट मी डिस्कस एस पी एल आई टी दिस फंक्शन सो ही आर आई राइट सी एस पी एल आई टी दिस पर्टिकुलर फंक्शन आई एम वर्किंग विथ नाउ सो आई विल राइट हियर फर्स्ट वी नीड टू राइट द सेपरेटर सो द सेपरेटर विल बी से डैश डैश राइट सो इफ दिस सेपरेटर इफ दिस डैश इज फाउंड इन द गिवेन स्ट्रिंग सो इट दैट विल सेपरेट द सेंटेंस इन टू नंबर ऑफ वर्ड एंड वी हैव टू सेट द लिमिट आई हैव गिवेन टू इट विल सेपरेट ओनली टू आफ्टर दैट इट विल नॉट बी काउंटेड सो लेट मी एक्सिक्यूट अदरवाइज यूल नॉट एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड सो ना इफ आई सेव द फाइल एंड एक्सिक्यूट एंड लेट मी राइट हियर आई एल ओ वी ई लव माई कंट्री इंडिया सो यू कैन सी दिस सेंटेंस आई हैव रिटर्न राइट एंड इंस्टेड ऑफ स्पेस आई हैव रिटर्न डैश सो डैश विल बी taken as a separator right and the limit has been given to that means only i and love these two word will be printed other three word will be ignored let me show you so i and love and you can see comma this comma has separated two word has been uh, printed i and love and it has been separated by comma right now if i give here space so this space as a separator will be accepted so now you can see if i write this it has no space that means it will not work okay so it has no space so i have not given any space so you can see without space it will just go and write simply because it has no space right so if i give space instead of dash now you can see i love it has been shown it has been printed why because limit has been given to and by space it ha it has been separated if i write here 5 then the limit will increase it will print five words let me show you 1 2 3 4 five all five word will be shown i comma love comma my comma country comma india i hope you have understood so now we are going to discuss about this start with right start with so it should have the search value and from where the start the searching must start so i can simply write here x dot s t a r t start w i t h with x dot s t a r t start 
W I T H with right and now here I will write that start with we are going to find start with say I okay so this if the sentence start with I if the sentence start with I then it will return true it will return true if the sentence does not start with I it will return false right it will this start with method either return true or false so if the searching string whatever string I am searching so if that string start with the search value which is given over here the search value which has been given if with this search value the string has been started right then it will return true if the string has not been started with this search value then it will return false and keep another thing in your mind this start from where I am going to start the searching from where I am going to start the searching that play a significant role see if I start from 0 that means the first location is always 0 now let me execute now I will just check if the sentence is starting from I the f if the first character is I so I love my country India you can see the first character at 0th location that is I right because I will be searching from 0th location and the first character it has been given I right right so it will return it will return true it will return true let me just go and check again start it will start from first character it is also case sensitive remember it is also case sensitive right st starts with s starts s t a r t s starts with right now in enter full sentence so i love my country india true because i have been found at the starting now if i just do one thing if i start searching from 0 1 2 location not 0 not 1 not, uh, 2 location that time in that location I am st uh, st starting the searching so the searching will start from that particular location this location searching will start from this location if in that location I, I is there then only it will return true otherwise it will return false let me show you so you can see the searching will start from 2 2 means just see this is 0 this is 1 this is 2 from here so it is written L not I so it will now the method will return false right right if I now write here L O V E if I write L O V E and if the searching start from this location now let us see true why true let me show you here I am searching for love L O V E love and the searching will start from this location right so starting with love starting with love and we, we are going to search from this location now let me show you 0 1 2 right so we are going to search from 2 this location and the word that we are going to search that is love now let us check over here love that that will be found in the tooth location right now it will return true so you can also ask the user to give value 
so enter surge value surge value so here instead of love you can write we can write y so what we are going to search right that will be given by the user enter search word enter search word so the word that we are going to search that will be also given by the user and that will be saved in y so here i have written y this word we are going to search for so let me execute i love my country india right and the word that will search for love love and that will be search in position searching will start from second position see true it will return true right so you can also do one thing ask the user to enter the search location and that will be saved been z here you can write z right now user will give everything user will write the string that will be saved in x user will write the word that we are going to search for that will be saved in y and from which location that will be searched for that will be saved in z so user will give everything now if i just write here i love my country india india so here i will search the word i love i will i am going to search i love and from which location the searching will start from zero location is it true found true right otherwise i love my country india now i will search for love love from which location say five from fifth location i am searching for the word love in that sentence will it be found no false because that has not been found in that location you can simply write here document dot write you can write here x x value you can write here after that you can also write the y value right after that you can also write the z value okay so that you can check it out see i love my country india right now i will search for the word my now which location my 1 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 location so here i will write i am searching for my and from location 7 will it return true or false so just see x y z okay i here i'll print x value of x concatenate after that 
I will take a line about uh, then concatenate right and I will print the value of y again I will take a line and after that again I will I will take a line after that I will print the value of z here again I will concatenate over here oh document d will be in small letter right so I love my country India right I am searching for my 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 in seven position now see I love my country India I am searching for the word my and that th and, and, and the searching will start from seven position right now one two three four five six seven it is true it is it, it turned true so this is how this start with method work and end with method is just opposite of that uh, start with method right opposite of the start with method so just here the it will it will searching will start from end see the end with method return true if the string ends with a specific string okay if the string end with a specific string so let me execute here instead of start with I'll write here e n d ends with right e here ends with right now same thing will be there I will just go and execute so enter full sentence I love my country right now I am searching for the word India so I will write here I N D I A India I N D I A India and also I have to write the length so I don't know how much length of character I have written so I will just write 16 or 15 whatever else I will write it will return false it will return false because I have not given pr appropriate length the length you can you have to count the length 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. So 23 should be the length, right? So, okay, so let me execute this one. You will try this thing, okay? Or you can also write here uh, location you may remove and at this position you can write x dot l e n g t h right so here you can get the length now you can execute see asking for uh okay so So I'm going to search India. I N D I A. So minus one you have to give minus one. I told you it should be minus one. I N D I A India.
okay this is not working i will check it later but okay fine so let us discuss this thing substring it is very 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 important substring so what this substring will do this substring will ex or, or extract part of string right this substring will extract the part of string from the longer string substring will extract a part of small string from the lo uh, longer string so let us execute see sub str s will be str see here you write s u b s t r s u b s t r right and from where to where so again i will ask the user to give this two value start and length start and length so user will be asked to give enter st start and enter end z so just let me execute so i'll write love country india now this is the longer string and from this longer string it will extract a short string from where to where that i have to mention from where to where so the starting will be from where let me write 5 and till where the end up to the end uh, let's say i will write 11 5 to 11 now see 5 to 11 it has been extracted out 5 to 11 and this is the long string so now you may st you just go and ca uh, count from 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 you can see from here it has been started and 5 6 7 8 that means length from where to where you can see length that means from here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so you can see you can count 11 character has been printed so just see you have to uh, give the starting and the length so length I have given 11 length I have given 11 and starting from 5 so this is how the here you can give just length L E N G T H length now let me again do it so enter full sentence if I write we all are very good student right this is the full sentence that I have written now I am asking to give the starting value from where it will start cutting extracting will start from where that I have to write let's see uh, 6 from 6 it will start from 6 location from 6 location now you have to give the length let's say 10 10 character long so we are going to extract 10 character from the long sentence from the long sentence we are going to extract out 10 character and that will start from 5th location right from 6th location we are going to start extracting out the character and how long character we are going to extract 10 long 10 see 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 right now you can count 6 that means the space all this from this space from this space 10 character 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 right 9 10 10 character can you can you see over here 10 character has been printed so here you will only find 
वन टू थ्री फोर फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड वायर आर अदर थ्री कैरेक्टर दिस स्पेस दिस स्पेस इज वन कैरेक्टर एंड वी हैव अ स्पेस आफ्टर वाई आफ्टर वाई वी हैव अ स्पेस दिस कैरेक्टर एंड बिफोर ए ऑल्सो यू हैव अ स्पेस बिफोर ए वी ऑल्सो हैव अ स्पेस बिफोर ए हियर फ्रॉम हियर राइट सो टेन कैरेक्टर हैव बीन एक्सट्रैक्टेड आउट आई होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड नाउ दिस सब स्ट्रिंग सब स्ट्रिंग इज सेम बट इंस्टेड ऑफ लेंथ यू हैव टू गिव यू एट द एंड वेयर फ्रॉम एट द एंड वेयर इट विल स्टॉप कटिंग राइट सो सबस्टर एस यू बी एस टी आर एंड सब स्ट्रिंग इज ऑलमोस्ट ऑलमोस्ट वर्क सिमिलरली एस यू बी सब एस टी आर आई एन जी बोथ आर सेम बट दिस शुड बी द एंड नॉट द लेंथ सो दैट इज ऑनली द डिफरेंस so just go and see over here in case of sub string we have to provide the length of the character of the short string which we are which we are going to extract out but in case of sub string what you need to do you have to provide the end start value and end value we, this thing we have to provide so so we all are very good students start we let us start from 6 okay and uh, it we are going to end at 11 6 to 11 6 to 11 so you can find 6 7 8 3 4 character 4 character 6 to 11 4 character that has been extracted out only 4 character 6 7 8 6 after 6 that means 7 8 9 10 Okay, and eleven will not be counted, right? Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, right? From here, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, right? Eleven will not be counted. So you can see this five character has been extracted out. the space two space before and after two space also has has been extracted out that uh, space you can't see over here but there are space right i hope you have understood now just go let us move on so java script lower case and upper case okay so so it will just go and convert the string into lower case so whatever string we are going to provide over here that will be converted into lower case right so this is the function you have to write string dot to locally lower case right so let me save the file it will convert the string to lower case so here i will write my name b b i s w a j i t so b i s so i written in upper case it will be Converted into lower case, right? So let me save the file. Okay. To lower case. Okay. Oh, yes. So B I B I S W A J I T. So I have written in upper case. It will be converted in lower case. So uh, upper case to lower case. Very simple. Just see. X will hold the uh, user-defined string, and it will be converted to lower case. Right? Understood? Now let us see this one. This this is also same. It, this thing will also convert to lower case. This both a similar type of function. Just let us execute both will convert the upper case to lower case right both will convert upper case to lower case so if i write here in upper case i n d i a india so you can see in lower case it will be written right 
and here now this function will convert lower case to upper case lower case to upper case so you can see lower case to upper case so if i write i n d i a so india i have written in smaller case it will be converted to upper case right and another function to upper case this will work similarly it will also convert lower case to upper case so let me show you if i write bishojit in smaller case i have written and it will be printed in upper case right very very simple no fine and now trim this trim function will remove all the extra space this trim function will remove all extra space t r i m see t r i m here i will write t r i m t r i m right so it will remove all extra space just see see so i have given space now i will write b i s w a j i t again i will give this much space now again i will write m u k h e r j w so uh, again i will give this much space so all the space will be removed and that will be printed see only single space it will take single space extra space will be removed by this trim t r i m so there are two kinds of trim l trim and right trim separately you can use also right now see string include right include function includes so it will just check whether uh, the word is includes or not okay includes just see here i'll write i n c l u d e s includes okay so here i will ask the user to enter word right that will be saved in y right now it will be it will check it includes or not okay it includes or not so we have to give search value right and starting position search value and starting position so here i have i will give the search value y right here i will write y search value okay and starting position i will write from zeroth location from zeroth location okay so let me execute so i love my country so i have written this thing now i am going to search love false that has not been found right why we have entered the word and searching has been started from zeroth location from the zeroth location and why holds the word that we are going to search from the string right and x that is the string full string the value of the full string why holds the word that i am going to search in that x string and searching will start from zero location right and let us see what is it in over here search value and it will start from the location it uh, okay so includes method return true if string contains a specified string if if string contains a specified string otherwise it will return false it is case sensitive so here i will write i l o v e love my country right now if i search m o i my it will return true i told you it is case sensitive case sensitive right my has been found if i write we a r very students so i am going to search d w d good right so 
from this string I am going to search G double O D right now if I write here G double O D so this D I, I have written in capital letter as I told you that this method is case sensitive case sensitive it will return false see it will return false right but now I have again written the full sentence we are very good student now here I write G double O D G double O D that have written small letter so small letter that will match with the string good would uh, now it will return true fine I hope you have understood now this C H A R A T C H A R A T so here I will write C H A R A T C H A R A T so this will just read this index of our string right and it will return that right let me show you from the string x okay from the string x this location index will be extracted out just see b I S W A J I T have written and we can see 2 2 means 0 1 2 S S is there at the 2 location so that will be shown over here S right I hope you have understood if I write here 4 so it will just extract the character that is at this location let me execute b i f w a j i t now find 1 2 sorry 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 0 1 2 3 4 a a will be printed over here right i hope you have understood now this one c h a r C O D E at C O D E at so here you have to write C O D E now what this function will do this function not only extract this function so I will do one thing here I will write this function C H A R at here I will write in the next line it will be printed C H A R code at now let us understand the difference between so all the location is 4 in 4th location will be extracted right let me show you B I S W A J I T now just see A 4th location it has been written A and here 97 is showing why 97 is showing it will return the ASCII value ASCII value of the letter which was positioned at that index so I will just do one thing here I will print X right let me show you line by line this C will be printed X value well X of X value means this thing what the user will give that will be printed N uh, after that what the location we are going to extract that will be printed after that ASCII value so I N D I A so India India see 0 1 2 3 4 so A is at fourth location so I am searching the fourth location a is at the fourth location that has been extracted out by this C H A R A T and we have to mention the index location right string dot C H A R A T and then index location right and now 65 has been shown because of this method 
C H A R character then we are getting the ASCII code of that character code at the fourth fourth location that means ASCII value of A if you go and find the ASCII value of A that is 65 the ASCII value of capital A is 65 right so that has been printed so how you can find the ASCII value of a given character by this method char code at right I hope you have understood this all functions all these functions are very 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 important to write long program to build a basic front-end application this thing will be required for the validation purpose right user will give different kind of data and those data has to be manipulated right and for and it is not always allowed to uh, to accept all kind of data so sometimes we need to put restriction in the front-end application so that user will user will be only allowed to enter restricted data so how can we implement the restriction how can we fetch the filtered out data uh, user may provide number of data right so you will just uh, deny all kind of unused data which, which are not required different character user are going to uh, give that we have to avoid for security purpose we have to avoid certain character for security purpose not only that sometimes we it is required to search some defined string from a long string also you need to find out the position so when requirement will arise you will you will understand the importance of today's lecture all this function is very much important I will uh, suggest you just to practice all the functions by yourself very very slowly I have discussed everything in this video only because that if I discuss slowly uh, repeatedly then you can uh, understand better so it will be easy for you to understand so thank you for today in the next class uh, I will just discuss about another method on click method uh, we are going to design a very simple basic uh, on click event to uh, calculate some figure out ok so in the next class uh, we are going to discuss about that so thank you for paying attention until the end of the lecture.